Welcome to my channel. Today we are doing bar scales. So the first thing that you'd notice that um, they are going to give you a bar on the map. Okay. In this case, we have at the corner there 0 to 600. But we need to measure that in order to find the scale that we're going to work with. Okay, so the question then says, use the bar scale shown to find the actual distance. If the measurement on the map is 120 millimeters from the electric workshop to the city hall. Okay, they have measured these two points for us and it is 120, right? But then we don't have a scale. So we have to then go to a bar scale and we measure. So when we measure a bar scale, we measure Five centimeters or 50 millimeters. I will work with 50 millimeters because they have already measured for me in millimeters so it's going to be easier to work with millimeters. So map as to real life and that would be now that would be 50 millimeters which represents 600 meters in real life. Then we will have 120, which is what we measured, and that will be x meters. That's what we need to find out, right? Then I go for my cross multiplication, which I call the seventh method. I'm going to say 120 multiplied by 600, and then I'm going to divide by 50. So the black part means multiplication, and then the green part is division. So when I read this, I'll say x is equal to 120 times by 600, and then here comes the green part, divided by 50. And then the answer, guys, that you are going to get is 1,440 meters, because remember, all the real-life measurements are in meters, and the measurements on the map are in millimeters. That's very important. We need to stay consistent there. Right, so if they say, okay, you should write this in kilometers, then we really need to go ahead and convert. So kilometers, meters, centimeters, and millimeters. So we would have three stars. That's for a thousand, two stars for a hundred, and one star for ten. And we are going from meters to kilometers so we're going to divide guys when we're moving backwards towards the margin we divide and we're moving forward just like you're reading a sentence you multiply so our x will read as follows x is equal to that 1440 right and then you then now multiply so you're going to more sorry you're going to divide you are going to divide divide by a thousand and then the answer you get, remember, when we divide by a thousand, we're going to move our comma three times. And so answer will be 1,44 kilometers. And that's it. Okay, guys. So for this question, we have a different bar scale. We have a bar scale from 0 to 100 kilometers, and we've already measured that, and it is 14 centimeters or 140 millimeters. Okay, so since my question is in millimeters, I am going to measure in millimeters. Guys, that is important to be consistent when you measure here in centimeters, then it means that also here you're going to measure in centimeters. Otherwise, you'd have to do all unnecessary conversions. So we would want to avoid that. So map as to real life. Then we know that um, 140 millimeters represents 100 kilometers in real life. So we have measured 290 millimeters and we have x kilometers that we need to work out. So we'll say then x is equal to, right? And then I go for my cross multiplication, which I call the seventh method. It is 290 times by 100. And then now we divide. We are going to divide by 140 millimeters. So in this case, let's just read it. 290 times by 100, that's the black part, and then divided by 140, and that is the purple part. 
right? And then, then our answer will be 207,14 kilometers. And that's it, guys.